Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, PrincetonTrader.com, here with your Tuesday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, daily chart to begin with. And you can see, you know, we've got that trading range. You can also see the two yellow bands to the outside of that trading range. Those are the Bollinger Bands, and they're beginning to tighten up again. Uh, will they become as tight as they were last time? I, I seriously doubt it. I think this is just your normal, you know, compression and, and expansion. Uh, the, the key for me is which side is going to break above 68 or down below 35. If we want to be in a 30, you know, 30, 32 handle trading range for a little bit, that, that's, that's okay too. What we saw yesterday, and we might as well get right on the hourly chart because the daily chart really hasn't changed. As, as you look at the hourly chart, you can see here's the overnight tonight. We talked about yesterday testing the area of weekly pivot daily pivot we were trading up here is very typical during the course of the regular session that's exactly what we did it was done in a very whippy kind of sloppy way that you know wasn't really crisp to trade but um the way it panned out you know effectively it was a it, it was a it, it was a test of the monthly pivot that held they walked it back up overnight but they couldn't take out the highs from yesterday at least not so far, and for the last two to three hours, we've been fighting over the weekly pivot at 54. So as we head into today, the Bears need to take out yesterday's low, down in the 46s. They need to take out yesterday's low and then go explore the, the, the support zones down there, 32 to 37. What the Bulls would like to do is just hold it right here. Get into RTH, make a higher low versus yesterday's low at the weekly pivot, Take out the Globex high and go ahead and, and, and walk it up to 67, 68 and see if they can break above. Um, I think it's going to be a battle. I think this morning is going to be a battle. I think you're going to see more whippiness in the morning. You're going to run everybody in and run everybody out on either side of that weekly pivot. Then once we get kind of an anchor for the morning, we can see are we making higher lows? Are we making lower lows? Um, and the day will kind of fall together from there. But what I would say is this. Um, we're dead pan in the middle of a big old trading range, okay? Um, basically, you know, we are 17 above and, and 17 below, you know, four, well, 13, 14 below the high. It needs to reveal the next move. Don't get chewed up waiting for it to reveal the next move. Be patient, watch the key areas, and then trade them. That's what, you know, that's what we're doing in the room. It's what we're going to do today. And it's what, you know, it's what will serve you very well. So everybody have a fantastic day. Follow us at Twitter, at Princeton Trader. Come check out the website, PrincetonTrader.com. Come check out the chat room. I'll be back tomorrow morning with another webcast. Trade them well, everybody.